but uh, I have to concentrate on this one and not you because this may not upload whereas I have more confidence in this camera here so sorry about that anyway but uh, again when I th this is a continuation of my video series called Sunan Abu Dhabi 22150 in the spotlight and the spotlight again according to depending on where I put this uh, video uh, I have a feeling that this video is going to be deleted but this one won't be so if it doesn't like make a mass produce mass copies of this kind here okay which is better quality than this one okay all right and when I do my words I'll be using this on my face I do the Muslims that side, <laughs> the other side. Yeah. Plus, I'm doing a mock Arabic accent, even though even though he's not doesn't even speak Arabic. He said, I, "But you want to know something? Most Arabs, most Muslims don't know Arabic. They recite the Quran. They learn to recite the Quran. They don't know what they're doing. Far better to study the Quran, if you ask me. Study the Quran. Don't recite it." I mean, don't memorize it to to for rec to recite it, you know. When I mean, you don't even know what you're saying, but memorize. No, not, but but study it. You need to study the Quran and the Hadith, not memorize the Quran. You're wasting your time. Study it. And what I'm doing here with this videos, I feel, is a part of that. To study it, you know, and expose it, you know. So. Continue here. I think we'll go back a little bit here. Uh, you hope? And you have said that Quran 424, the above verse from Quran and Abu Har Hadith are complementing each other. I thought he said that. Uh, the first part of 424 certainly does. And the first part of 424 complements Sahih, sound authentic, Muslim 834-33 as well. You have also argued that the expression, quote, in the presence of their husbands in the Hadith allows Muslims to rape women. Right. For why would the husbands consent to have their enemies that defeated them in battle let the Muslims marry their wives? Didn't you say that when I know he didn't now, but at the time I thought when I wrote this, I, I got confused with the hadith I wrote. Uh, hadith that I read it says that when um, a Muslim work cap, when when a woman is captured in war, her 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 her, her marriage is annulled. I haven't sent him that hadith yet, so I know now for sure it was from the hadith and not him. Yeah. Uh, who, uh, by the way, who said it was annulled? Her non-Muslim husband said it was annulled? Where in the Quran or Hadith does it say that he consents to having his marriage annulled? Where? You don't see how, the, how evil this is, do you? You simply lie! Who has da well, hey, who has Dawah 22150 as Muslim 83432? I mean, who, 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 who set it up that way? Who? Here is why. Uh, Quran 4.24 Abu Dawud 2150, the English translation, do not compliment but conflict with each other. Oh, he's saying the conflict now. I guess he's finally getting his act together here. False. They fit like hand in glove with with that having intercourse, rape of captured women, quote, in the presence of their husbands who are disbelievers. Uh, B. The original Arabic text of Abu Dawud 2150 does not mention in the presence of the English translation is totally wrong. <laughs> and he says he doesn't know Arabic. <laughs> uh, if so, then why does the site you gave me have it as the way, has, has it that way in English? You know, you liar. Here is the site one can go to to find it out. And it's it's HTTP uh, slash uh, Suna.com. Actually, you know, so just type into your web browser, Suna.com. Uh, I'll be down with, you know, 12. Uh, and just, just actually go. Just type in sunnahabidawud.com. No, t no. Type into your web browser sunnah.com, and when you go to that site, that Muslim site. It's not an anti-Muslim site. It's a Muslim site. When you go there, type in Battle of Hunain into that little website, little uh, website that uh, that little web browser it has, and it'll take you right to all those different hadiths that have Battle of Hunain, and you look for in the presence of their husbands, and when you find it, it's. And we find it under Sunan Abu Dawud, that's it. Yeah. 
And when you go there, type in your web browser, Battle of Hunain. Then look for Sunan Abu Dawud. It won't give you to 2150, but it will, it will have it if you scroll down and look for, quote, in the presence of their husbands with the Battle of Hunain. In our previous discussions, I have copied and pasted the original Arabic text to the Hadith. Liar! For the Arabic of that website, sunnah.com, can't be put through Google Translate. I tried it. It failed. Liar! Anybody who understands Arabic, and he said he didn't understand it, will uh, be able to tell you that it is nowhere in the Hadith, quote, in the presence of their husbands mentioned. Then why does that website, sunnah.com, have it that way in English? Why? As an alternative, you can put the Hadith into Google Translator and see yourself that uh, quote, in the presence of their husbands not mentioned. False. And a lie. For the Arabic of Sunnah.com can't be put through Google Translate. I tried it. It failed. Liar. This is a clear proof that the English translation is corrupt and you cannot be in, in, you cannot be relied upon. <laughs> oh, oh, that is corrupt and cannot be relied upon. False. And a lie for why does a why does that that website sunnah.com why does it have it that way in English the way I, I always been talking about it as having why liar see book eight number thirty four thirty two Sahih Muslim mentions about the same hadith right that's the one you said was Dawood two twenty one fifty you liar. The translation here is more reliable. It says, Muslims withdraw themselves because of the women's husbands being polytheists. But not soon in Abu Dhabi 2, 2150, as that, that Muslim website shows. Uh, in Islam, Muslims are not allowed to have sex with polytheists even if they are slaves. Not when you take into account uh, Muslim, Sunni, uh, Sahih, Muslim, Sahih means sound authentic, Muslim 83433 and Dawud 22150, you find out that due to them being polytheists, it was for that very reason that the first part of Quran 424 was handed down. Go to that website. Uh, he, I want to tell you something. Go to that website he mistakenly gave me for, you know, I don't know. Yeah. Yeah. Go to that website he mistakenly gave me, folks, and see who the liar is here. You know? Many scholars argue that you have to wait until the slave convert to Islam. Not enough, if you ask me. Then you can marry her. But apparently, you can have, quote, you can, quote, have intercourse with her in the presence of her husband, who is a disbeliever. You can have, present, you can have sex with them in the presence of their husbands, who are disbelievers, non-Muslims. Check out that site, sunnah.com, and see what I mean, people. See what I mean. Marriage does not mean raping. Not non-Muslim marriage. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Not non-Muslim. Yeah, you mean marriage? Yeah, marriage does not mean raping. No, not in Muslim and not non-Muslim marriage. It doesn't. Uh, you cannot rape your wife. Exactly. But with Quran 424 and how it's handed down in Dawud 2 20 and 50, you can ha quote, have intercourse rape of women in the presence of their husbands who were disbelievers, non-Muslims. You liar. Uh, D. Both Muslim 8, 30, uh, 34, 32 and Abu Dawud 2150 are the same hadith. Liar. They just tell of the same event, the same incident. And just one has a more different twist on it. That's all. And neither of the original Arabic texts uh, can we find in the presence of their husbands. Liar. Then why does that Sunnah.com, that Muslim site, not, not, not anti-Muslim site, but that Muslim site, have it that way for Dawud to 2150, you know, where you can ha where it says presence of their husbands. Liar! This expression in the Abu Dawud English translation is totally wrong. Liar! Then why does Sunnah.com have it the way, you know, in presence of their husbands for Dawud? 2150 in English. Liar. Feel free to 
get it verified through a native Arabic speaker or use Google Translator yourself. False! False! For the Arabic for that site can't be translated in Google Translator. Liar! Now we tell you, anyone interested, go to that site, sunnah.com. Copy and paste the Arabic into Google Translate, and you'll see what I mean. The Arabic he copied and pasted could be translated to Google. I, I tried, and it did. But how do you not know he just didn't take the English version of Muslim, Sahih Muslim 83432, put it through Google to turn it into Arabic, then copy and paste the Arabic and say it was Dawud 22150. Thus, thus everybody, go to that site, that sunnah.com site. Copy and paste the Arabic that's there of Dawud. When it says when it says uh, the one that says in the presence of their husbands in, in English, but when there's Arabic there, uh, yeah, copy and paste the Arabic into Google Translate, and you will see that it can't be translated like this lying Muslim says. By the way, people, what does it say when Islam has to defend with lies? Has to, when, when 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 Islam has to be defended with lies? What's this say about Islam? Any guess? No. Yeah. Well, no wonder Oblamer lies like it's nothing. Uh, finally, uh, uh, you have been telling people that Islam allows raping. Right. With Dawud and Muslim. Right. And you have been trying to back up your claim to Abu Dawud 2150 and doing a superb job, I must say. And thanks to you for giving me H you know, Sina.com. Anyone can see what I mean, what, what I now mean. You know, I think I better quit here.